What's up everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm gonna talk about how to fix the Roblox is not launching on your Windows 11. Whenever you try to launch, you're having the trouble with the Roblox and how we can fix this app. So let me directly get into a step. So the first one is all about, we just need to just go to this particular site over here. So the first step, just go over here. I'll be providing a link in the video description that will take you to this. And right now, what we need to do is we just need to go to this link. And what we need to do is over here, as you can see, we have to copy paste the version. So I'll be giving you a default copy version over here like this. So that will be in the description. So you don't have to worry. Copy this description number and you have to paste it over here. Once you paste it, just go for download. So once you go for the download, it is going to take a little bit of time. So what happens is this is going to, we need to wait because it's going to extract all the packages to get downloaded while doing this. So it is going to take a little bit of time. So once it's successfully all downloaded or extracted, it's successfully done. We need to save this particular downloaded to the, Ro the Roblox's file, which we downloaded from this particular site. We need to wait and we need to save it over here at the desktop and we need to extract it. And afterwards you can try launching it. So this particular extraction is going to take a little bit of time. So we need to wait. And, uh, you know, I will be skipping this if you wanted to, because if it's going to take a lot of time, so let me just wait. So once it's successfully downloaded, you just need to go over here. And what we need to do is we just need to go over here and we need to save this particular one. We just need to save it. Just go over here and we need to paste it. So right now, as you can see, this particular one will be over here in the desktop. Open this because it's not extracted. So we need to extract it. That's an important one. So uh, just wait for this. Okay, just expand this. And now we need to go for extract all. Click on extract all. And we need to extract it. Just go for extract. So uh, it is going to take a little bit of time. So once the extraction is completely done, we need to launch the Roblox. So this is 100% working method, which I did even I had the issue and I found it from the Reddit where one of the person shared this particular method and I checked it and it is working for them as well. For me, it worked for me as well. So I'm going to show you guys as well. So it's going to take a little bit of time. So let us wait. So guys, once done, as you can see, this is the extracted. So it is on the desktop. So after the extraction is completely done, you have to scroll down. Now we have the Roblox player beta, right click on this one and we need to launch it. So the Roblox will be launching without any issue. And this is what you have to do. So now what we need to do is you can just go over here and you can now, as you can see, the Roblox is fully launched in my case. So I'm not having the trouble. You can try this. But apart from this, if you're having the trouble, what we need to do is even afterwards, you might be having the trouble with the version. If that is the case, just go over here, search for the run command and you have to click on this one and just go over here, type percentage local app data percentage. And right now from here, you have to scroll down and navigate to the Roblox. Now from you get into the version. So I'm having two versions here. So already I have given you one step that is downloading with this particular version, which is in the video description. If that is not working, just go here for some users. You might be having two versions. So if that is the case, just go over here. You need to sort it according to uh, the date. So just make sure that you sort it according to the date. You can do it. So uh, based upon the date, you can change it. And as you can see, the first one is 20.04.2025. So in my case, both is are on the same date. So what I'm going to do is right click on this one, go to show more options and you can select this one. Just go over here and copy paste this particular one. So you can go for rename, but you should not be renaming it. Just copy this particular, you need to copy this particular path. Just copy this particular version. So make sure if you're having the two, you have to do like this, sort it according to the first one. So, but if you're having single, single one, just copy the version that you're available here. But I'm having two, so I have to configure according to date and time. Now you just need to do over here. So now once you're done with this one, you just need to go over here or you can just click on the sort based upon date. 
So right now, as you can see, if you click on the sort, you can see this is the first one and this is the second one. So I have to right click on this one. Once again, let me select this, go to show more option, rename it, but I'm not going to rename it. Just copying this version, right click and copy this. Now close this, go to this particular over here, remove this particular, which I have given you first already. I have given you one thing in the description, just remove it, paste this particular one and go for download. So this time it is going to extract it once again. So it is going to time. So do the same. So already you can try with the uh, with the available package version I have given in the video description. If that is not working, use the temp method. Then you have to get into the folder and just copy and you have to use it and just do the same as I did and it will be working. So if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. That's it. Bye bye.